thank you so much for tuning in to uh, Android Vision. I hope you guys enjoyed Popcorn the movie. I really enjoyed it. Like you said, three horror movies in one. Yep. But kind of in the fourth wall, uh, we get this girl who's getting having bad dreams. But what we find is that she was a part of a weird film cult. Yep. And her mom didn't tell her. Mothers tell your children when you're in a cult. And the guy was giving a acid. That he was. Yes. He was giving a acid. It was like kind of like Charlie's family, Charlie Manson, but... It was with movies. As yeah. opposed to killing people. But it was really cool because they they revamped this old movie theater. Called Dreamland. Yep, Dreamland. And all these people show up dressed all funny and cool and they show the fucking movies. And they have like, there's one Japanese movie, which is the third movie, and they have like stink pellets, which makes them smell stinky stuff from the movie. And then there was a shock chairs where they put shocks into all the chairs in the theater. And what was the other one? The buzzing flying. Yeah, the, there's a big giant bug that'll come right at you. It just flies. Gotta watch out for that. Watch out for the bug because he seems to be a, a point. He's of, got some problems. Yeah, he seems to be a point of a, a problem for some of the people in this film. Yes. However, popcorn the film, great movie, good acting by the by the main villain who I haven't seen in a long time. I don't even. He was actually in My Girl right after this movie, which is a really big departure from his role in this movie. What happened to that guy? I don't know. He's probably living somewhere. Somewhere. <laughs> that was a good response. Macaulay Culkin. Oh no. He died in My Girl. He he didn't make an appearance in Popcorn. He got stung by bees. Aww. I know. Ruined my childhood, let me tell you. He died. Oh, that sucks. When? Yeah. By bees. He yeah, died. he got killed by bees. He was with Macaulay Culkin. He was watching he was over. Stung him. in the anus by Michael. Hey. <laughs> he. He died. I have a good friend who. Oh, that sucks. No, listen. I have a good friend whose grandfather died of the same thing. Oh. Well, see, that makes me sad now. Sorry, and, mister. You did a good villain. He, not only did his grandfather die of the same thing, his uncle died of the same thing. Damn. Yeah, well, within like two years of a part. No more drugs for you. You bring them down the alley. What did he die of? AIDS related AIDS pneumonia. Pneumonia. Oh, uh, well, you know, you gotta strap it sometimes when you smash the ass. I mean. Condoms are good, kids. It, not even that. Vagina, ass. You guys just wear condoms, please. Please. It, it doesn't matter, but. It's you a know. creepy ass world we live in, please. It is. Wrap people, it up. I like that ass. What a nice. What a nice guy. But hey, R.I.P. Grandpa Dick. We'll never forget you. Yes. Um, anyways, guys, Popcorn the Movie. Great fucking film. Great ending. Good, good prosthetic makeup. Great acting. The movies within the movies are entertaining as hell. I, I enjoyed it. Me too. Very it was, much so. It was nice early. They say the good horror movies weren't made. This is a nice, good early 90s horror film. Yeah. Yes. That, that was. Um, go check out The Sleeping Car as well. Yeah. You can find that on YouTube. It's a nice early 90s horror film as well. So I really like The Sleeping Car. I kind of bunched the 80s and the early 90s together because it all just kind of rolled into one. Really? So, And a lot of these were filmed in the 80s but didn't come out until the early 90s. So, so I hit puberty in 1990. So my childhood was the 80s and then it was all over in the 90s. And now he's doing drugs. Yes. And that was it. I'm so, not sharing drugs. Yes. I'm not sharing Sorry, rest of the bus or van, whatever you are. I'm not sharing any. So anyways, guys, uh, up sharing to our mail segment. With Vanessa Alexandra. For it's July, right? Uh, for you kind of lose track when you're out here on the road, man. Everything starts looking the same after a while, especially in the desert. But we got some good mail. This is from Bill Buzzardhead. Android virus, do you embrace any of the other elements of the genre? I can read. Outside of films, such as comics, gaming, books, music, etc. Comics, yes. Gaming, no. Books, yes. Music, yes. Etc. Maybe. Depends on what the etc. entails. Like, I'm not into going to um, cons, like conventions. You know, people go. You like going to conventions? <laughs> well, yes, I mean, they're awesome. I've gone to Fetish Con. I've never been to that. Yeah. It looks like fun, though. Yeah. Um, I went to Fetish Con. Um, that was fun. I've gone to a couple of Comic Cons, but I didn't really care for them. Yeah, the one in San Diego, it's fun, but there's just so many people. It's getting, it's overwhelming. I don't even like going to that anymore, just too many people. And there's not that much horror stuff there for me, so I'd rather go to the horror base. I loved, I've been invited, and you're invited, uh, to go to 
uh, Days of the Dead convention oh, in, hell yeah. in Atlanta. I have so many friends that go to that, so yay. Yeah, Atlanta. So I think that would be a great one to go to. Uh, Days of the Dead in Atlanta. Uh, if I can make it out there, I will go to. With Mr. Xander Kane, by the way. Hi, Xander Kane. Hi, Xander. I love you, my brother from another mother. Um, so anyways, yeah, there you have it. Music, obviously. Comics, yes. I stopped playing games when I was probably 18, 19. Oh, gosh. And I think I stopped playing video games at that age because um, I just didn't have time for them. That makes sense. I just didn't have, I, I just don't have time to sit in front of the TV for hours on end. Yeah. Well, I I say that and I watch shitty horror movies, <laughs> but I mean just to play a video game and drool, but I do the same thing in horror movies. One of my favorite video games is Splatterhouse. If you haven't played it, I recommend it right now. We're going to go play it after this because I have it. Yay. Awesome. Um, See? Yeah. So I have it. We'll play spot the RV out. is bigger than you think it is. It is, guys. There's a basement. It's a big screen TV, all kinds of stuff. There's a basement to the RV. It's a grower, not a shower. And That's right. <laughs> <laughs> grower, keep not. Keep that in your mind. Yes. Just keep telling yourself. And that. our third piece of mail is from Freddy No Fingers at Android Virus. Are you a fan of the I Believe Cancelled series? True Detective. It got cancelled. Fuck. If so, which season did you prefer and why? <sighs> I'm Mr. Freddy No Fingers. Um. Yeah, Mr. No Knuckles. Knuckles. Yeah. How did, how does, Mr. Knuckles. Yeah, I, I don't know. It his might be smooth feet. right here. Yeah, his feet. There you go. See? The driver knows. He has feet. Yeah. Possible. If they're big enough. You're limber enough. Yeah. You'd have to do a lot of yoga. And you'd have to be double jointed. Yeah. Double jointed yoga? They know up in the front. They know this stuff. Hey, buddy. Mr. Masturbator, no fingers. Make sure you take Boniva so your hips don't crack when you masturbate. I'm yes. just going to put it to you that Are you way. aware of that? Yes, Boniva. Old pretzel hips. So, um, <laughs> so True Detective. Uh, I loved both seasons. S- season two got shit on, and it's not because what the fans wanted. And I get that, but as an artist, are you writing for the fans or are you writing for yourself? I think as an artist, you're writing for yourself because you're actually uh, projecting your own demons out there. Um, I'm not trying to please your demons. I'm pleasing my demons when I do this stuff. And so um, season two for True Detective, I thought was really good. Um, But season one, I can't like, fuck. Like, cue it up here. Uh, The girl that's tied to the tree with their horns sacrificed to the Yellow King. Oh my God. Season one of True Detective. So good. We actually... We may have the star of True oh, Detective shit. season one here. Really? Uh, well, he jumped on our RV because we were smoking. He smelled something. Yeah, they do that. You want to say hi, Mr. Matthew? Well, I, I was going to go ahead and play the bongos as soon as we're done here. But, uh, you know, we got uh, we got some weed. We got a little bit of LSD going on. We're going to have ourselves a nice little time. It's a party. It's all over with. All right, uh, Mr. Matthew, thanks for showing up with us tonight. And uh, He just happened to be at a festival. We drove by, sniffed some drugs, and here he is. All right, all right, all right. Good person to have in a nice situation. All right. No. Summer of Android Vision continues. Next month, we're going to head home. It's August, right? August, man. Ready. I love you all. I love you. I love you, too. I love and, you guys, too. And Vanessa Alexandra sticking with us for the summer. I'll still be here. We'll talk to you soon. Well, how can I send you a little letter if I felt like oh, yeah. I'll write to you next month? Oh, yeah, man. This way. Android Vision 666 at AOL.com. Also, check us out at the Intestinal Fortitude. Check me out on Twitter at Android Virus, on Instagram at Android Virus, and also Tumblr at Android Virus. Now, I warn you, when you go to the Tumblr, there is some nudity there because I do like uh, re- uh, blogging uh, 80s boobs. Ain't doing lady. it right if you ain't getting nude, my See, brother. Matt knows. <laughs> yes, thank you, Matthew. Yes, <laughs> yes I like the 80s uh, girls. I, I, I just, I like that look. I don't know what it is. I mean, they're hot. I like Agreed. It. Yes, they're hot. They're so, hot. anyways, um, there you have it. So, where can we find you, Miss Vanessa Alexandra? I am Living Dead Nessa on Instagram, and I'm just the real Vanessa Alexandra on Facebook. I don't have Tumblr because I suck or Snapchat or anything like that, but I'll be on his as long as he can function. So, yeah. I, I will be sober next episode. Yes. I promise. All right. By the way, I've been looking for that flesh eater because he's been doing things on your little website. Oh, gosh. We need to have a little talk as soon as we're done here. Sorry, oh, man. shit. <laughs> All right. I know what you're talking about, Matthew. Things are going south here on the RV. Flesh eater, you are fucked.
All right. Watch out. See you next month, guys. Thank you. Bye.